Everybody, welcome back to another game at all.com Twitch cast. I'm Lucas Grimm. We're back with Ultimate Alliance and um, that last level was very dull. So Spider I'm hoping Woman. things uh, pick up here. So let's see. We have Okay, apparently I need Miss Marvel. Ms. Marvel. Storm. Storm. And Let's see, who else do we need? gonna get some special characters for coming up uh, here so I guess I don't need anybody else really Electra so yeah why not now for some excitement While you're at Mandarin's palace, I need you to bring back the latest Ultimo schematics. No one's sure. Tome of Asarius is an ancient mystical text that explains alternate dimensions. It deals primarily with Mephisto's realm, the Halls of Fear, and the Shadow Realm. All we know is that they've taken the Super Soldier Serum, the Mutant Amplifier, and the Tome of Asarius. That's the question everyone's trying to answer. So far, we don't even have a guess. And that's why you're going to talk to Mandarin. According to Namorita, Masonic emitters are completely destroyed and the Atlanteans have begun cleanup of their city. No, quite the opposite. They're grateful. They understand you had to battle them to save their city from Atuma. Certainly. Hello, Electra. Hello, Black Widow. He is a genius who has developed ten rings of power from alien technology. His palace in the Valley of Spirits is protected by a gigantic robot known as Ultimo, very. But Iron Man could fill you in on the specifics. He and Mandarin have been arch enemies for years. It is a valley in mainland China where Mandarin discovered the wreckage of an ancient starship, the Axan Khan, dragon-like creatures from the planet Maklu 4. Their technology is still centuries ahead of us. He reassembled it in a deserted castle in the Valley of Spirits. And while working with this advanced machinery, he also discovered the Maklu and Power Rings. They were intended to serve as energy sources for the warp drive engines of the alien starship. But Mandarin converted them to his own twisted needs. My apologies. I should have given it... You are most... Welcome. Do you have a question for him? He was the son of one of the richest men in China. But he was orphaned at an early age and was raised by an aunt who despised the world. Yes, something of a scientific wonderkin. Mandarin attended very prestigious schools both in China and abroad. There was a change in the power structure of China. And Mandarin lost all of his wealth and power. Anxious to return to that lifestyle, he ventured into the Valley of Spirits, in hopes of making a major discovery. It is an area in China that had long been deserted. There, Mandarin located the shattered hulk of an ancient alien starship, the Axon Car, dragon-like creatures from the... that. I am... Hi, it's good to see you. 
I hope you're ready for Mandarin, because he's no pushover. Their advanced technology that Mandarin took from the wreckage of an alien starship. He adapted them to serve as weapons. They offer a wide range of attacks, from force fields to ice blasts to disintegration beams. They make Mandarin a very dangerous man. That's a robot created by Mandarin to battle Iron Man. It's huge from what I hear. Ultimo's programmed to destroy all life in its path. The skin covering the robot is virtually indestructible. Hmm. Ah, that's right. Nope. All right. All right. That password you gave me worked like a charm. I had no problems getting into S.H.I.E.L.D.'s database. You are gonna love this. The Imperium, it's a S.H.I.E.L.D. think tank. You know, one of those places where they get geniuses together? Uh, no. But I can find out by hacking into the S.H.I.E.L.D. priority database. But I need help from one of the few guys who can crack that code. C.B. Sobolski. Or a guy named Baroge. Look at that guy glitching out right behind my like Spider Woman. I need you to talk to Hank Pym and find out which of those two guys I can trust. All right, all right. Greetings, Spider Woman. May I say you look quite smashing today. Jarvis, are you flirting with me? <laughs> Why, uh, <coughs> certainly not. That would be most unprofessional, regardless of how attractive you are. All this commotion with the S.H.I.E.L.D. personnel has me somewhat flustered, I'm afraid. And then there's the matter of the... Yes, I find this Mr. Weasel to be quite unnerving. You never know where he's gonna pop up next, not to worry. The S.H.I.E.L.D. personnel... They haven't set foot in this area. I think Colonel Fury and his people prefer to stay near their equipment. You have my... It was... I can't tell you how much I'm looking forward to seeing Mandarin again. It's gonna be like old times. Oh yeah, me and Mandarin go way back. I've been locked up in his palace so many times I've thought about having my mail forwarded there. A genius, psychotic, delusional and out to kill me with a vengeance. It all started when I was kidnapped back in my youth. My heart was damaged and my kidnapper refused to get me medical treatment until I know. Another scientist oh, we already know this part. So. Yes. For the longest time I wore a chest plate that acted as a pacemaker. No, my condition was corrected and now my heart is fine. Any to Hey, how's it going? That it's a think tank? Yeah. But the big question, well, are they good guys who are helping humanity? Or are they bad guys who are coming up with new reality shows for TV? Now you know. I am glad we were able to help the Atlanteans. While Namor is somewhat headstrong, he is a good ruler. You are. Hi. Can I help? Yes. People are saying she was trying to get... There's still not enough evidence to convince me. And if you can't convince me, Fury will never believe you. While attempting to stop a missile heading for London, I fell into the ocean and was frozen. I stayed that way until they fished me out decades later. Yes, I'm sure it was the super soldier serum that kept me alive. But I've got to tell you, it's been quite a shock getting used to these modern times. <laughs> I've yet to figure out VCRs. You can tell how old this game is now. <laughs> yes. His name was Buck. He died in an airplane explosion. Or it's a... Any time. Hey, what's this? I've heard people complaining about S.H.I.E.L.D. since we got back from the Omega. I'm telling you, it's gotta stop. I trust Nick Fury. He's pulled my fat out of the fire more times than I can remember. Look. Fury does what he has to to keep the world safe. He ain't always got the luxury of playing by the rules. I've known her for a while. She's always been good in a fight. 
And fear it unless that meathead weasel comes up with better evidence. I ain't believing nothing against the Black Widow. That guy's head was on backwards. Of course I am. He's been loyal to me. After all the trouble I had with the hand recently. Uh, let's just say that evil bunch of psychos got hold of me and turned me into their assassin. It caused a lot of people a lot of pain. But Fury helped me out. Kept me alive. Sure. Okay, well, let's talk to Prim. Find out what he knows. Get back to Weasel and then go to the Valley of Spirits. Hi, it's good to see you. Sapolsky? Oh, yeah. I knew him back at MIT. A real computer genius. Too bad he ran with the hacker crowd. Well, on a dare, CB tapped into the financial system of a major electric company and gave everyone 50 cents off their next bill. <laughs> yeah, but I've got to hand it to CB. He never gave up the names of the other hackers he worked with, even when he was threatened with jail. No. Try vision. I bet. So CB no sounds problem. right. It sounds good. Welcome, D. Barrage. Yes, he is a computer criminal from Canada, wanted in several countries for ID theft. Definitely, Barrage has executed several very sophisticated crimes, but I would recommend you stay away from him. He is not trustworthy. The last time he was caught, Barrage gave the authorities the names of his accomplices in exchange for his freedom. No. I am... Okay, CB. Hey. All right, let's get going. It's time to go fight Mandarin. Your ploy in Atlantis worked. My good doctor, how could you doubt the god of mischief? My performance as Mandarin was flawless. Rest assured, the heroes will travel to the Valley of Spirits. I wonder who will be the worst for this confrontation. The heroes or Mandarin? It matters not, so long as one of them pays the ultimate price. The traitorous Mandarin will most likely meet his demise. But not without destroying several of Fury's lackeys first. Indeed. I would find it most enjoyable if my dear brother Thor were to fall in battle. Long as he been a thorn in my side. Oh, don't look so sad, Enchantress. When our ultimate plan is realized, you will find others more worthy of your attention than Thor. I should hope so, Loki. Still, it saddens me that Thor must die. He is truly a god to be admired. That pompous fool's overdeveloped physique is nothing compared to my conniving intellect. Now oh, I have longed to crush his self-righteous countenance beneath my booted heel. Silence! All of you. My scanners show the heroes are in the Valley of Spirits. We have set the stage, and the players have arrived. Now. Let us watch and see who will survive this tale of deception. Well, we know it's a trap. We've arrived at Mandarin's palace, Colonel Fury. All's quiet. Let's hope it stays that way. That's good to hear, Storm. Now all you have to do is track down Mandarin and ask him about the Masters of Evil. Tracking him down shouldn't be a problem. But living long enough to ask him questions might be a little difficult. Storm, I didn't think anything scared you. I'm not frightened, Colonel. 
just cautious. I've faced Mandarin's rings of power before. I hear you, Storm, but I have every confidence you'll succeed. You have to find out what Doom's planning next. All right, my friends. You heard the Colonel. Let's see if we can locate Mandarin. Not much of a fight. What did I just say? Well then. So, uh, I just got wasted. Because, I mean, there wasn't even a chance there. Okay. 
Don't say how easy that was. Do not comment on that. Yes. Okay, more things to do. Powered up. No, I want to go to change team.
Let's move, people. We're on the clock. All right. Oh, hold on just one second. That's where I am. I gotta switch over. I gotta go fight Grey Gargoyle. All right. I don't like rooms like this. Let's get out of here. Fits. Okay. Yeah. 
Come on, really? Alright, we got the ultimo. The last one is Marvel on the way. so much about why is he French close but no cigar you must be thinking of the amazing spider man no 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 it is you who are amazing I have never beheld such a beautiful creature before put your hormones in neutral Pierre you're having a reaction to my pheromones it's a power I can't fully control yet hmm Perhaps uh, you are right. I do find it difficult to think in your presence. Yeah, I get that a lot, particularly in bad situations like now. Ow. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
defeated Great Gargoyle. Ms. Marvel is still down. No 
Time for a mission, team. Actually, wait. I do need to switch up a couple people. Keeping Storm. Iron Man. By him bringing in Iron Man. We'll go, we'll go with that. Spider-Man. Deadpool. I must have a different outfit for Deadpool. Nope. Not at all. Okay. Spider Woman. Wolverine. Yeah, there we go. Considering we're about to, for some excitement. what we're about to fight, 
gonna need it. So, still you persist in this foolish quest of attacking me in my palace? Very well then. I will unleash my latest creation, the Ultimo Mark II! Correct. Its enriched titanium casing is laced with vibranium, and the servo motors are 300% stronger than the previous model. So you see, it will be quite impossible for you to destroy this robot. I've done it before. And he's already down to like... Strange in the middle of a battle. Greetings, my friend. It is most fortuitous that you chose to arrive when you did. Mandarin's minions were becoming quite bothersome. A precious magical item known as the Orb of Agamotto was stolen from me. I managed to track it to this location. I do not know how Mandarin intends to use it, but I must retrieve the orb immediately. Splendid. Let's team up and see what we can find, shall we? Ah, uh, yeah, we have the Doc on our side. Second best doctor out there. That was almost too easy. Okay, they're just gonna...
return to current mission. Ah, shit, Iron Man's down. That's how you do it. We've located the orb. In return for aiding me, I will now make myself available to join your team, should you require my talents. All right. Doctor Strange. This is definitely much better than uh, the Atlantis level.
Stay down! Now I got some real power! Okay, here we go, Mandarin. You may have defeated those incompetent louts throughout my palace, but now you will face the power of the Mandarin! You shall soon learn the foolishness of such a body. My rings of power will annihilate you! I'd like to test in a real world situation. Allow me to introduce my latest creations. I think they'll be quite attractive to you. Oh, really? It would appear my creation is odd enough, but fear not. My prototypes of Ultima Mark III have more than enough firepower to make short work of you. Do it. That was almost too easy. There we go.
I'm the best at what I do. Come on. Hitting with lightning. Yes. I left Doom's band of miscreants weeks ago after I attempted to become their leader. Most likely it was that pompous Loki. He has the ability to shape shit. Obviously to keep you busy while they enacted the next step of their plot. Team, once you're finished with Mandarin, return to base immediately. The masters of evil have kidnapped two X-Men. Nightcrawler, Jean Grey. <laughs> Crap. Welcome back from Mandarin's palace. It looks like the masters of evil managed to pull a fast one on us and kidnap two X-Men, Jean Grey and Nightcrawler. For the next part of the operation, we're moving our headquarters to another location. When you're ready to go, talk to Mr. Wingfoot. We are. You have the Ultimo schematics. Good work. The lab coats are going to spend weeks looking at these. All right. I guess everyone is, uh, we're all ready to go to the uh, next location. And I think that's actually going to be our uh, stop point for tonight. We'll come back and we'll be at uh, the Inner Sanctum. Alright. Thank you for watching. We'll see you guys next time.